You have a debt to pay. You've been captain of the Black Pearl for 13 years. That was our agreement. Technically, I was only camp for two years. Then I was viciously mutinied upon. Then you were a poor captain, but a captain nonetheless. Have you not introduced yourself all these years as Captain Jack Sparrow? <laughs> you have my payment. One soul to serve on your ship is already over there. One soul is not equal to another. Aha! So we've established my proposal is sound in principle. Now we're just haggling over price. Price? But I wonder, Sparrow, can you live with this? Can you condemn an innocent man, a friend, to a lifetime of solitude in your name while you roam free? Yep, I'm good with it. The cat's out of the bag, Mr. Turner! Your issue will feel like staying here for the bosun's hand by uh, your own. Bootstrap Bill, you're a liar, and you will spend an eternity on this ship. <laughs> Master Turner, feel free to go ashore. The better next time we make bolt. <laughs> Jack Sparrow can best the devil. Open the chest. Open the chest. I need to see it. The creation of Davy Jones was a long and difficult process requiring the hard work and ingenuity of many different departments. Modeling, painting, rigging, animation, R&D, and TDs all had a hand in bringing this character to life. Since Davy would most often be seen in tight close-ups delivering dialogue, a great deal of time and attention was given to the fine details of his face. Fine wrinkles, scars, barnacles, and general crustiness were added as displacement maps created in ZBrush. Much of the character of Davy's face comes from the sense of history that these details suggest. Davy's facial animation system was extensive. Modelers created hundreds of controls for the animators to use in order to convey the subtlety and complexity of the human face. Special care was given to the eyes, as this is where the attention of the audience is most often focused. A procedural approach was required to bring to life the 46 tentacles of Davy's beard. The tentacles needed to collide with one another, react to forces, and have a life of their own. The level of realism required and the complexity of the movement ruled out a keyframed approach. Since Davy's performance began with Bill Nighy on set, it was important that the acting choices Bill made be represented faithfully in Davy Jones. For this reason, an on-set motion capture process was created. It allowed Bill to create his performance during first unit photography rather than on a motion capture stage at a separate time. Since Davy and Bill have very different faces, it was necessary to transform Bill's facial performance into Davy's. This was a creative task, one we felt best left to animators who as actors would have a sensitivity to Bill's intention as an actor, rather than merely the mechanics of his facial movement. For this reason, Davy's facial performance was keyframed by animators rather than by using a facial motion capture approach. <laughs> 